Charlene and Tyrrell, a tough game this morning. Uh, it was. It put us to the test now. Um, you know, Drummer here came down from senior last year, so we always knew it was going to be a tough one, you know, but oh, we're not out, you know. We have a semi final now to look forward to, so the only way is up, I suppose, <laughs> after today. <laughs> Obviously, this year uh, you're looking to maybe go one better than last year. Today, a little bit of a setback in that regard, but I suppose you always knew you were going to have to battle to win any championship in this county. What's the, the outlook now with the two games left and between you and that silverware? Well, look, we, more ladies, are 12 years now without winning a championship so we're a long time um, you know trying to win a cup we won a league in between that but that was a good few years ago and they don't come round too handy championship county finals like so we know what work we have to put in and we know you know what level we need to be at so I suppose a game like today is good you know you can't you need a blip I suppose on the way there to really test the team so in terms of the, the team selection today, obviously a lot of girls unavailable for various reasons, injury, other commitments. How much of an impact does that have on the team? Look, we're very lucky this year. We're carrying a panel of 32 girls, you know, so we're lucky that we have the, you know, the standard of players on the sideline to call upon um, who probably only lack a little bit of, you know, the game practice really you know the competitive games when they come on but I think like at the moment everyone's really fighting for their position so games like today you know we're missing the likes of Dervla and Emma you know Kiva Cannon it gives the girls on the bench an opportunity to come in and prove themselves as well so you know we don't try and look at it as a negative point of view we're just trying to take all the positives really out of it all you know every team I think at the minute suffering injuries you know with lockdown and everything <laughs> now we're back into like football every day. <laughs> in terms of modern sport, I suppose psychology comes into it as well. So yeah. how much will uh, taking a defeat today against Drummer here, if you potentially meet them further down the line in a semi-final or more likely possibly a final given how form has gone, um, is it an opportunity maybe for them to come in maybe a little bit lackadaisical, lackadaisical into uh, a final or do you think it won't really matter when you get to that stage, if you get to that stage? Um, I don't know. I think it comes down to the day. Do you know, um, I'd like to think we'd meet them again in a county final. Do you know, and that's and them winning today. I'd like to think that they would never go away and think, you know, we have to beat Namohal again. Do you know, mm. that's we'll definitely use it to our advantage, and we know we can play better than how we did today. You know, so. You've read on a couple of championship campaigns here in Mohol. What's it like playing home games for the first time, possibly in your career as a player um, in, in Mohol in the championship? For sure, it's great to have the home games, you know, and um, especially after not playing for so long. But myself, like I'm only back properly playing with the Mohol ladies the last two years, you know, so. And when you're looking at nearly the end of your footballing career, you're, you enjoy every game, the, you know, more all the time, and especially when they're at home. It would have been nicer now, sweeter to have the victory today. But look, you can't win them all, I suppose. I was going to ask you how enjoyable today was, because on the scoreboard it didn't really oh, look great. Oh, Jesus, every time you look over, like, I think that's the most disappointing part for me. Like, I missed two points myself, you know, from right in front of the goals. And to look down, and we've had such high-scoring games, to see three points on the board, it's a, bit, a little bit unbelievable, you know. But um, I suppose you miss, you know, Dervla in there today. She'd be a key player, but, like, look, we just have to... Get over that. I'll have to get more accurate, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> hard luck today. Thanks for talking to us. Oh, you're easy after a defeat. Ah, look, we've we've given ourselves a hard time now, so we get the negatives out of the way and onwards and upwards, I suppose.